All right. Let's get an admission too, shall we? You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, we can select a new uh, group member to join us in this one. I think I'm going to go with Iris over here because she has plus three fighting experience and food production. Feels like that's going to be pretty damn handy for us. Oh, wow. She actually starts with a Zealot's Medallion too. Okay. Increase the subject's faith from killing humanoids by an additional 10 points. She's a zealot, too. Okay. Let's do this, man. Lords, the wild folk, they've attacked our gourd. Hurry oh, God. Now, or there will be nothing left of our home. Nothing left of our home. Okay. Defense is breached. Game paused. Right, 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 right. Enemies inside the gourd is considered breached. Time automatically paused. Okay. Let's get over here, man. Charge! I'm just looking at the minimap to see where objectives are. Oh, God. I'm spazzing out the minimap a little bit too hard. Let's get the hell in here, man. Can absolutely mold these intruders, dude. These little wild men of Dunland. They're messing with the wrong people, dude. Oh my God, they're strong, though. They are tanky. Even with very little health. Sire. Those bloody savages. Unusual. That doesn't yeah, yeah. The wild folk are usually pacifists to us, but... The knight is not like Edwin. Me, personally, I'm starting to like Edwin, man. He's grown on me. At least he's pragmatic. Okay. Building, repairing. Okay, structure damage and repairs. La, la, la. All right, man. Cool. <laughs> Repair the palisade. Let's do that. Does it really take like 17 people to repair the palisade? We've got lots of stuff to repair here, actually. The lumber yard, the scout's tower. There's the palisade repaired. Okay. Let's pause. Queue up some repairs. Uh, Eshka, you can get over here. Oh, yeah. I, re I, re I lowered down Snieshka's name to just Eshka because, you know, it's easier for me to say. Mm -hmm. Should probably point that out. We didn't get rid of Snieshka. Snyesh Can't even say it now, dude. She's just Eshka now. Why is her name in red? What's that about? Oh, it's her low health, right? Yeah, she tanked a lot of damage in that last fight. Okay. Cool. Everything cleared up. Very nice. Get the scout's tower repaired. What do we got over here? The forager's hut. Um, Iris over here. Probably be a forager for now. Let's get her over there. Attic is also a pretty good forager too, right? He's a good scout as well, though. I guess we'll get him on food production for now. Get these two foraging. Um, we need a woodcutter. Which I guess is going to be Dobrin. Get him over there. As soon as he's done with that job. Bron, what are you doing? Oh, you're the reed gatherer. Okay. Go start that job. Uh, Eshka for now. What is Eshka doing again? She's also a good forager, though, look. Maybe she should be foraging, too, man. Yeah, I don't think Arik should be foraging. He's got too much exploring and uh, fighting experience, right? Okay. Switch places, man. Let's get Arik on uh, scouting. On scouting duty. Everybody rotate jobs. Mila, get over there. Clear that rubble. Eric, okay, there we go. Eshka's taken over. There's now a free spot here. Very good. Cleaning up rubble. That's awesome. Uh, what else do we actually need now? But we should equip our subjects with proper weapons to better prepare for what awaits us outside of our walls. Okay. Let us build our first military structure. Awesome. Cool. Yeah, so I believe military units... Uh, require gold as upkeep. I don't think we have any way to actually make gold right now, though. No, we don't have any mines or anything like that. So that might be, might be on a bit of a clock in this mission. I know you can find gold out on the map by, like, looting bodies and stuff. If I, like, zoom in on the minimap. I like, a lot. God, okay. Yellow herb, red herb, brawn, loose stones, corpse, corpse. Okay, so we've got some corpse already that we can loot as well for extra gold. I guess I should be doing that, man, with my uh, scout units, right? Get over there, take care of that. Mela, what else are we building right now? We have one person on reeds, right? 
Do we have a reed gatherer? Yeah, the thatchery. Forager's hut. One forester. Two scouts. Okay. Very good. So we are going to need some extra crap, though. Scout's tower we don't need. Hunter's den. I think that would be fine for food. With the forages that we have. Um, do I just build, like, the axe pit right now? Probably, right? Archery range. Ooh. Okay, axe pit is much cheaper, though. Let's get the axe pit for now, I suppose. Put all that down here. I'd also like to have an additional gate, but that costs 100 wood. I'd like to have another gate around here. Because right now that is super far away. Eric is on scouting duty. These are just herbs. What's that I could do? Screw it. What the hell was that noise, bro? Oh! Who are you? 17 gold. Ah. Okay. So we're gonna pay- oh my, that's a hundred gold though, man. A hundred gold? What are these items? Plus 20% attack damage to Zagach. I don't even know what Zagach is, bro. 20% attack damage to Bloodworm. Okay, warm clothes. I mean, that's much cheaper. Buy the warm clothes, maybe. Then again, it's a common item. Ah! I don't know what- I don't really know how to judge the value on those, so I guess I'll just leave it for now. Loot the damn bodies. Okay, this is another thing I don't like. Um, there's a few things I'm, I have a big problem with with the UI in this game. Um, first is that a lot of the UI elements are floating off the screen. Like these side buttons here, like see these side buttons on the UI? They should be like against the screen like this. You know, they should be like right up against the side of the screen. The map is too far off the bottom and off the side as well. You should tuck the map in, make it smaller. Um, yeah, full screen map just feels like pretty useless too. I don't know, man. The map just feels too 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 big. Same thing with the character portraits. They could move over. The big black background on all of the uh, resource numbers up at the top as well should just go. Like, you can just remove that completely. But look at this, man. If I'm looking at the minimap and I'm, like, scouting around on here for stuff to loot with my scout, which is what I'm doing right now with Arik, if I select Arik, I can't see the minimap. That's a goddamn problem. That's a big goddamn problem, dude. Now, I can minimize this. But, like, it reopens every time I reselect the guy. You know what I'm saying? Like, that ain't good, dude. What the hell is that? Because this game's definitely got teeth and issues, dude. It's currently got, like, 48% positive reviews only on Steam, by the way. I don't think it's that bad of a game. I think people are being a little bit harsh. Uh, but at the same time, like, come on, dude. There's some things here that really, for, like, a, like a 30 quid game... Like, these things should really be fixed. Um, okay, the loose stones. Loot a bit of reeds from that. That's very good, very dandy, very sick, very awesome. Uh, okay, let's get you back in here for now. Okay. So we have Mila on scouting duty as well. What else am I looking to build here, man? I guess I just want to explore. And explore quite quickly. Would be the goal. But we're going to need one scout. I'm going to leave Mila on scouting. Because she's been my scout for the whole game so far. Um, Iris is currently on foraging. Probably just don't need that much food. Uh, Arik. Can maybe take over on food. From Iris. And Iris can get over here and become a warrior. Where's she going? Iris, damn you. Go become a warrior, goddammit. And then we have Mila follow Iris around, like on guard mode like that. Because she has the torch when we go outside, right? There it is. That's good enough. Let's search for the cartographer. Okay. Was supposed to lay out the best route for the gold transportation. My people have seen It's very good, very good. In a couple of times. Yeah, yes, yes, good, good. We can do this, man. We, we, we're well equipped for this now. Eshka, Bron, Arik. All right, man. Mm -hmm. Let's get out here and see what we can see, shall we? It's a bit of red herb. 
Another NPC we can interact with. Let's do something like so. What's this guy selling, man? Plus fighting experience. Oh, wow. 135 gold, though. Oh, my God. That's a lot of fighting experience, man. So, yeah, I feel, I'm not going to do it because I just don't know how much gold I even have access to on this map. There might just be, like, nothing here for us. Iris, damn it. You part of this command group or what? Get moving. Um, I feel like I... Okay, there's actually, like, mobs up here as well. There's mobs up here as well. So we have two people foraging right now. We probably don't need two people foraging. Let me pull some people off of this real quick. I'll pause for you guys. Okay, there it is. We totally handled it. Rejigged everybody by quite a bit. Let's pause. Get these noobs going on down here. Mila, Iris. Let's head towards the objective, shall we? Let's get this done, men. Because every second we have warriors up and running. And they're not actually partaking in combat. Then they're getting like anti-value, right? Okay. It's finished. We've got a lot of nerds here. Our sister needs help. Yes, she does. Yes, she does. Dobrin is also ready to go. Let's get him on over here. Add him to the control group. Yes. Well done, team. We did great. What are these? Are these the healing mushrooms? I think they are. Got a little treasure chest here. Nice, we actually picked up an item there real quick. I don't even have time to see what that was. Okay, well, if this is the cartographer, I have low hopes. Bogdan, <laughs> keep your people in line. Bogdan, your people are pathetic. Seeing a body mutilated in such a vicious manner, you would think that living here made us indifferent to such views. But it always takes a toll. Your barbarian <laughs> minds are weak. <laughs> this corpse belongs to yet another of your scouts. Your barbarian minds are weak. N no, sire. Judging from the robe, I believe this is the cartographer you were searching for. <laughs> Cursed lands. Ah, forget him. We need his maps. Search the hut. Search this cage. Search everything. Dude. I actually love the emissary, dude. I think he's great. Like, he's, he's very easy to hate when you first meet him, but he speaks some common sense. He's pragmatic. He gets the job done. The little goblin. Okay, man. Uh, yeah, don't let people's health drop to zero. They get a physical affliction. Same thing with sanity. They get a mental affliction. Sire, All right, cool. We have found the cartographer's notes in his hut. Does it say where to cross the river? I believe it in does, his my lord. But the marked route requires crossing the nearby swamps. It's a very difficult and dangerous area. You dare to question <laughs> the expertise of a royal cartographer? You hairbrain savage. Steward. We've wasted enough time. All right, all right, all right. We gotta head over this way now, huh? Let's do this. I think I just trapped. Uh, oh my god, there's traps everywhere, dude. Okay. So that's what the traps look like, bro. They are hard to see. Okay, a little pile of rocks here. Bit of food, very good. Okay, that sounds like just, just like a demon spawned up ahead. Um, real quick, let's pan on back over here and make sure that we're building like healing buildings for a little bit later on. Uh, the Meadery or the Balia? Let's, I guess, just get the Meadery for the time being. One get like right there, man. I don't even know who's available to build that, but someone will get to it eventually. I mean, let's see what demon awaits us in the dark. 
Someone has harmed our system. Oh my god, oh my god, man, these things do a lot of damage. Run around a little bit, Mira. Gonna backstab him. Jesus, there was a lot of damage. Okay. I just want to see if there's any of the lootables here. We're getting a little bit... Taking a little bit of spooky damage, but... Dude, this is like... Oh my god, what's over there, bro? You know what, man? Just loot this skeleton. One of y'all's loot the rocks. Irish, you could do with recovering a bit of sanity. Get that yellow hair in you. Do we keep going? Yeah, we keep going, man. Take out these damn spiders, too. Sounds like spiders. They're chittering at me. Oh, okay. I thought it was little monkeys there for a second, dude. Really getting pretty low there. Very good, very good. Oh no, he's eating them with the wrong person! Oh my god. I meant to get Iris on these herbs. Okay, you know what, man? Maybe we just go back and heal for now. Maybe that's fine for now, man. Save our cash. I guess I shouldn't also have, like, soldiers just idling as well. That's probably just also a really, really bad thing. Um, so I should, like, change their jobs. Food. Reeds. Iris, Dobrin, get over here, I guess. Do something like this. Get building. Alright, man. Let's get everybody back home. Go, 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 go! Happy little expedition. I guess I need to get, like, the healing building uh, made as well. Okay. Speed things up a little bit, man. Yes, I just want to save my gold as much as possible. Like I said, I haven't really found much, you know? I just don't know how much is actually out there on the map. It's a little bit spooky. Okay, can I build the damn bathhouse? I can't, man. We have two people on woodcutting duty now. So that's going to be good. Um, is there anything else I can just like run out and loot? And just out of curiosity, man, if I was to build, like, a fishing fishing shack, do I have to build it on the water, or can I build it in here? If I build it indoors, like, in the building, uh, in the gourd, rather, I can't get my words right. Okay, let's do a little bit of scouting around here. More gathering stuff. Deer for the hunting lodge. Little rock we can loot. Somehow food in there, don't don't ask. Okay. That'll do, that'll do. Alright, man, we can now build the Balia. So we'll do that here. Get building that. Very nice. So again, we have a couple of forages. We just don't need this many forages, do we? Yeah, Dobrin doesn't need to be foraging, man. Get over here and help build this, man. Because we're almost capped on food. Yeah, the cap is still... Uh, the cap's only 500, man. I'm a little bit wary of that. Like over capping on stuff. Oh my god, are we about uh, I think we're about to unlock a new population here. That's going to be huge. Speed up, speed up. The settlement's growth has significantly increased. Very good, very good. Dobrin, I guess I make him a warrior again here. We go out for like another round too. Where's Iris? What's she doing? Okay, she's bringing back a log pretty soon. Now, nah, Dobrin shouldn't be a warrior yet then. 
And your time is just right, man, because otherwise he's just consuming gold every turn that he's a warrior, right? Like every second. Yeah, we just lost one gold for no reason. So we shouldn't make people into warriors until they're, like, absolutely required. Oh, what's this? A new life is welcomed <gasps> into the Goy. Let's go! Sigun! Okay. We have a kid. So I believe you can assign kids to follow people around. And then by doing so, they, like, begin to learn a profession as they go. Strengths, sturdy, plus max health. Do we take Sigun out to learn how to be a warrior? Also work driven though. Warrior's idle for a lot, so maybe that's really bad. We just want to keep her working. Maybe just let her be a forager. I think just let her be a forager, man. Who's our forager, man? Arik. Where the hell's Arik? Okay, there he is. Okay, child. Go ghost, Arik. Off she goes, man. Little Sigun. She's doing great. Proud of her, man. Okay, Iris, I don't know where you are. Oh, you were just depositing the wood. Okay. And it goes. Mila, you'll be if you're done in there. So there's a lot of little micro bits that you gotta do with this game. A lot of little micro bits. Which, like, I'm fine with for now, but I can imagine this getting a little bit much as the game goes on. Like, especially having to manually assign people to have a drink of mead to recover missing sanity. That feels like it's a little much. Like, can't we just, like, click on the meadery and set it so that, you know, people automatically go there once they drop below 50% or 30% or 10% sanity or something? Like, I feel like there should just be options for that, you know? Okay. All of that said... I believe we're now good to go. Iris, that's enough sanity. Go queue up over here. The A team is going out again. Everyone's at a bevy. Let's go, man. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's do this, let's do this. Little Sigin following around. Okay, I think that's the that little progress bar here that's building up over Sigin's uh, head or behind, beside her name. I'm guessing that's like... Growth. And she is slowly learning some food production experience as well there, so that's pretty good. Hopefully we get to like rank one or uh, sorry, rank two. Before she hits max. Okay. Build the points of interest. Oh hang on. There's just torches scattered around on the map. Oh my god, dude! We can kindle torches to forge a path through the woods. I did not even notice that. Oh, that's cool, man. That is cool. Okay, I like that. Which will help our gatherers and stuff maintain their sanity as the game goes on. Okay. That's really good. I can just see another torch poking up around here. Oh, god. Okay. Let's fight these clowns. I feel like our character should have green health bars and the enemy should have red. Make it much, much clearer. Give them lots of little bits of feedback here, man. As I go. Open this. Okay, lost a bit of sanity there as a result of looking in that, into that. I guess we should have did that, but... Iris, get yourself a tasty snack. There it is. Okay, so we lit the torch. That's all that matters. All right, let's go. Let's go. Got another torch over here. Cool, man. All right, so this is like guiding my exploration a little bit more, which I like. I do like that. Let's light this. Mm -hmm. There it is. All right, cool, man. Very, very cool. Okay, we also had more enemies up here. And the reason I want to like kill a bunch of enemies, like wherever we can... So we got men just herbs. Yeah, just herbs. Mm -hmm. Um, I just want to build like um mm -hmm. combat experience, fighting experience on a lot of my guys, you know. Whoa, 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 Dobrin. Dobrin, just stop. Stop what you're doing. Stop panicking. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is happening with the pathing right now, dude? 
What the hell was that? Come on, eat herbs. Okay, now turn around and just F him up. Our brother was wounded by a foe. Get him, get him, get him. Very good, very good. Nice. Okay, who took the most damage? Millie are quite, you're quite wounded. Okay, is there something here that we can take? There's a prison here. Oh, what the hell? Kill this goddamn sick son of a bitch. Wrecked. Can't loot the bodies, it seems like. Dobrin, get these herbs in ya. Iris, get these herbs in ya. Did Dobrin just eat both of them? I think he did, man. Okay, a bit of gold. <gasps> Griselda! We rescued a warrior, dude! Oh, welcome to the team, Griselda. You're gonna be happy that we found you. Let me tell you that for free. You're gonna do great. Great things with us. Okay, where's the actual objective? Bro, it's all the way over there. Okay. Let's go right through the middle, shall we? Don't see any more torch posts. Okay, dude, they're all just down here. Oh. More dickheads. Griselda on your feet. I don't even know if it was how we got knocked down. I'm just going to assume because she's a noob. She's a newcomer, man. Take these mushrooms, you'll do great. Okay, let's go this way, man. Speed of time. Move, 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 move. Torch here. Another torch here. Man, we really, really like our way here. This is great. I like this. What's this? Bit of health per second regen, okay. Another torch. We didn't even light it. Okay, we're making good progress now. Absolutely mully these wolves. God, so it's really dangerous, man. If one of your warriors gets caught out here alone. Wait a minute. Griselda! You weren't even here! God damn it, man. Add her to the control group, for God's sake. Okay, she's catching up, man. She'll get here. Got some stuff to loot. Bit of food. Some painkiller herbs. Very nice. Iris, take one of those. Dobrin, take the other one. Griselda is now catching up. We've run out of storage space for our food. We need to build... Oh god, we've run out of storage space for food! Okay, uh, basic storehouse? I guess? I mean, I only have one person farming food. So it's a bit nutty. I ran out of storage space so easily, but... Okay. Get a little storage side over here, I guess. Upgrade a storehouse. Okay, we did it. We did it. All right. Is this where the crossing is? Christ. Hell, she's OP. You don't just stand there. Help me. Okay. Seems like we should probably do that. Someone is harmed, our brother. Gank these sons of bitches. They said Barry is actually tanking for us, man, so we're taking no damage. Charge! We suppose you can use powerful spells. Oh, we've unlocked incantations. Okay. 
Oh, I can only use Fracture. Blah, blah, blah. Crush the limbs of your opponent. Taggart needs to be wounded before the spell may be used. Apparently not. For the tutorial, at least. I like how his buddy just stands there. God dog, man. You saved me. Those savages got what they deserved. <laughs> there you go, Edwin. Attacked our god and killed our people. But you. I am not. She's not from around here. Since okay. my village got destroyed. People call me Lynx. I am Edwin, Lynx. an emissary of King Isidore the Second of Calanthia. It seems we share common enemies. Boris <laughs> tricks. You pick them up if you live here long enough. But how come savages are a concern to such fine lords as you? <laughs> I'm Bogdan. <laughs> Putting some respect Dabo, on Edwin there, dude. Noble servants of Dabo. Dabo? The defeated god of the sun. Watch your tongue, witch. I've lived long <laughs> enough to recognize forbidden magic when I see it. Helping you is a mistake. <laughs> an old man. Undead, Calm down, I'm in Bogdan. You friend has some skills and a grudge against our enemy. I wouldn't mind a hot bath. But sir, you <laughs> yourself keep reminding us how dangerous these lands are. Okay. Well, we could use We could use some help. Yep, yep. Yes, sir. Very well then. Let us carry on through those swamps and across the river. There is supposed to be a very nice settlement there. Are you sure you need to go that way? Of course we're <laughs> sure, woman. Well, <laughs> I think I already got rid of most of the filth on the way here. But beasts, monsters, and wild folk living in those swamps drained my powers almost completely. Beasts and monsters? Beast Building monsters. a temple and assigning somebody to pray in it would help me recover much faster. Ooh. Believe me. <clears throat> yes, I believe that we all agree that safety of us, our subjects, is of utmost importance. Let's build this temple of yours first. Uh, may the gods protect us. You can take care of that, <laughs> Elder. Goddamn Bogdan just panicking, she's a damn heathen. Okay, so we build up faith. Faith allows you to use incantations. Okay. That's our faith resource covered. Let's build something, shall we? What do we build? The temple? Temple is where people pray to raise the gold's faith. Upgrading the temple unlocks new incantations. Okay. Guess we get this right in the middle. Who's actually going to build this, though? Like, I kind of feel like I should just get people back. Perhaps. On fire for a shrine. I've lit all of these, right? Yeah, I guess you should just get people back and get them uh, establishing new jobs. We could need to build some faith before we progress, I suppose. So let's do that. Griselda. What does she actually do? Okay, she's just balanced at everything. That's good news for us. Um, we can get an, put her on the forester job, I guess. I just want people to not be recruited as warriors, because we are bleeding gold really, really quickly. Dobrin. Similarly, I guess. Just, you know, wood. Storage space for our food. We need to build or upgrade a storehouse. Yes, yes, yes. I know, I know. Eric, just real quick. Go build the storehouse, bro. It's gotta be done, you know? Um, who else do we have? I just pause... We have another warrior, man. Iris? Yeah, Iris I didn't assign to do anything, did I? Hmm. Just be a reed gatherer for a little bit, I guess. Oh my god, when the kid is helping build. Little Sigun. Iris helped build that. Very good. Miller's building the temple. Alright, man. Everything is proceeding apace, I dare say. We have no one recruited as warriors right now, which I think is just a good thing. 
Iris now come over here and help with this. Then both of y'all get praying here. Sire, I'm glad that we found time to praise the true gods, but we need to proceed with our plan. The emissary is getting very anxious about it. Okay, okay. Reach the river crossing, which is all the way over there. Jesus, dude. Okay. So, we're praying like crazy. All right, yeah, this is something that I don't understand. So we are building faith for the settlement right now, and that's great. But we're also building faith on our characters as well. And I don't really know what that signifies, man. Individual faith is the contemporary faith rising... Uh, is the contemporary faith strength of this particular subject. I mean... Oh, screw I guess we'll just, we'll just figure it out as we go, I suppose. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Okay, Eric returned to work. That's a nice little keybind to have, man. The resume work keybind. So just get straight back on the job. We'll need to assemble the Avengers again real soon. Let's just keep on building faith for now. Let me have a look at the incantations. So we have sight, illuminate gloom in the area. Okay. Invoke mist that hides. Uh, your subjects from enemies. So they're quite cheap to use. Support abilities. Focus the power of the divine of the divine to increase the strength and speed of your subjects' attacks. Ooh, that seems pretty cool, man. Use that in like your best warrior. Uh, haste, increase movement speed. Ah, eh, doesn't seem that valuable. But what's this? We have another kid. The grace of the gods, a child is born. Mio brat. Let's just call him Mibi. I think Mibi's fine. Look at him go, dude. What's his natural proclivities? He's a handyman, he's a builder, he has a slow metabolism. I mean, this guy could be anything then. Building doesn't seem to be that big of a deal to get, like, super good at. Um, Let's assign him to Milia. We'll have one of the kids get some, like, fighting experience pretty soon. I think that'd be pretty cool. Actually, right now, just, just follow anybody, anybody for now, I suppose. Griselda will also become a warrior again quite soon, so... Okay. Thing is, men, we're gonna warrior it up here. We have so much gold that we still need to get. I'll tell you what, man, maybe. Can you go pray? Like... What if we do something like this? Just get Mibi on the prayer duty. What the hell? Why did I get like a notification of nearby enemies over there, dude? What's all that about? Alright, Mila. Let's go take a look around, shall we? Let's go take a look around. Our sister was wounded by- What the hell? Iris Leggett! Avengers assemble! Oh my god, dude. Uh -oh. Run, 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 run! Everybody, help! An enemy attacked our brother! And absolutely strive them out. Our Go team. Is being attacked. All right, man. Let's just mob this area a little bit. Okay, I think we got them. Okay, everybody, back to work. <laughs> you got that brawn arriving over here, dude. Super late. Oh my god. Okay, growth level village. I think we do an hide. Okay, just teleporting back to base real quick. Let's get a shrine down, I guess. I think this gives like area of effect faith. To like anybody in the area. Seems fine. I mean, that's just like a passive faith gain for anybody working in these buildings. Or anybody having a drink, like uh, Bron right now, recovering a little bit of stress. 
I think maybe that's good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just gained one point of faith here on Milo. Okay. Alright, man. Awesome. Very cool. Now, where's Iris? She's bringing back a bunch of crap. Okay, I guess it's going to be time to journey out again soon, then. I guess we're just going to go. I guess we're just going to do it. Alright, that's it. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. Iris turned in. We're good to go. Braun, get back to work. You're fine now. I think we have enough faith to cast like some abilities. I think that would be okay. Um, who else are we missing, man? Dobrin. We need to assemble the Avengers again, dude. Oh, hang on. <gasps> Sigin just randomly a gatherer as well now? She's not actually assigned to the building, is she? Do we make Sigin just like another scout? Or maybe like an archer? That could be kind of cool. Then again, she's sturdy. She has 10% max health. No, she's... She'd be pretty well suited to being a warrior as well. Okay, go a second. No, Bryn. Okay, everybody's gathering up here. Everybody get around the shrine, actually. Go, 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 go. Sigan over here. Why are you guys not moving? God damn you. Okay, we need one extra nerd. Do we have two people, like, reading or something? We have, like, two people somewhere, and they don't need to be. It's folks on here, man. Eshke, Griselda. That's who it is. Griselda? Go be a scout. You lot, let's do this. We're on a bit of a ticking clock here. Given that I can, I can, I can just see our gold just going down, dude. Going down real quick. Now, as soon as okay, there's Griselda. She's become a scout now. Very good. What the hell was that noise? Oh my god, bro! Someone has harmed our sister. Just absolutely maul them, dudes. Dude, we did big opening damage from these guys. These guys have a powerful charge, man. Like, really, really powerful. Screw it. We're just going to keep going, man. We're just going to push on. More beasts around here. You can literally see you there, you little Ned. You're doing fine. Griselda's almost here, right? My god, move! Child is just along for the learning experience. Okay. Some little bits of gold here, very nice. Plus fighting experience. You know what, maybe it's probably not a good idea that you're actually out here, man. I regret this decision. You should probably go home. Go hang out with Bron. I think that'd be for the best. Okay. Across the spooky bridge. Have food. Very nice, very nice. Alright. Now we're back to where we met Lynx. Progress across here, I guess. Off we go. Bit more gold. A bit more gold. That's really goddamn useful. Food. Reeds. What's this? Oh god, it's anti-poison. What the hell? Goddamn monkeys, dude. Oh god, we're killing them all at the same time. That ain't good. Gold. What's this? Food production experience. Okay. Blah, 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 blah. Anybody else need a quick heal before we continue? Get yourselves on there. 
So again, you take the de-stress uh, leaf. What is this? That was actually for an axe wielder, wasn't it? Who picked that up? Zealot's medallion. Who actually had that? What is this? Okay. Pretty cool. Wolf tooth necklace. Axe wielder's symbol. 10% fighting experience gain on Dobrin. I mean, that's pretty damn good. He's also quite leveled, man. Okay, man. Cool. Some of the items seem very, very, very inconsequential. While some of them seem, like, really excellent. What on God's green earth is that? A bit more gold. Okay, bro. Okay. Do we just like challenge it? Do you even know what's ahead of us? A river crossing? <laughs> yes. Which is also a horror's lair. It's known as Arduin. And it won't let you pass without a sacrifice. Sacrifice? We will wipe this monster from the face of the earth. <laughs> I like Edward style, dude. It's not an easy task, sire. No one has attempted such a feat in years. We would need a great deal of experienced warriors to have a fighting chance. It's much more than a monster. I mean... It's a sentient demon, conjured from the most vile souls that Bellus could stitch together in the underworld. I feel like I need to try this or limit try test, you know? I don't want to hear about a different route. We will follow the plan and give this creature whatever it desires, or kill it for all I care. <laughs> okay, horrors of powerful magical creatures guarding the wild lands. Eventually, every tribe has to either face the horrors, plagues, or satisfy their demands. Fighting them is extremely difficult. I mean, it's put that in yellow text, dude, which is scaring me a little bit. Like, what does it want? It wants to, it wants to sacrifice a child. Dude, I don't want to sacrifice a kid. Oh god. I don't know, man. Maybe we just attack it. Oh, let's just try it, dude. What the hell, right? Please wait, steward. Fighting a horror is a desperate act. One more foolish than courageous. Oh god, these horror creatures created by Velas himself, aided by his godly powers, incantations will do them no harm. Oh, for god's sake. It's literally convinced me. Can I just, like, Side later. Can I walk past it? Oh, cool, I can. <laughs> the horror is seeking us. God damn, kill it, dude. He's got damn ads. It's a good job I a good job I waited, man. Dude, is Dobrin dead? He can't be. No, he's just stunned, okay. Yeah, that's confusing as hell with the UI, man. If a character gets stunned, their health bar just disappears. Alright, I'm gonna kill it. No, everybody took in. Everybody ready to start wailing on this big dickhead. Okay. Everybody be ready for this now. Why is this happening? Mm -mm. One of you has to walk away to speak to it? Kill! Oh my god, oh my... Run! It does unbelievable damage. Why have you stopped moving? Why have you stopped moving? What are you doing? It keep running. Why aren't you moving, dude? What's happened? 
Ah, uh, it's uh, uh, someone in stuff on me. Does someone need to like grab you or something? I don't. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to get. I don't. I don't know how to make Iris move. What the? F what the shit? So like, what do I do? Like, what? They've got like a red fleshy thing on the. Does it mean that they can't run on their own or something? Like they need someone to go in and get them? Dobrin, I choose you. Why? No, what are you doing? What are you doing, bro? What the f- Right, yeah, cool. But why couldn't I move my goddamn characters? Yeah, good. And how long does it take? Five whole bloody seconds? Well, that's a goddamn disaster, ladies and gentlemen. Screw it. I guess we're just gonna leave this one here. I might just have to retry this bloody mission. Okay. I don't know what the hell happened with the pathing here. Um. But, like, multiple characters just got stuck. Fuck's all that about? That's actually quite annoying. That's the kind of thing that makes me almost regret purchasing a video game. But I'm going to withhold judgment for now. Thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you all enjoyed. And I'll probably catch you all's. Just a tad bit later.